Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new to my channel, my name is Artwork. Yes, because I love to work. And for those of you who are returning clients and customers, thank you so much for coming back and thank you for watching me. So on today's video, we are going to test out some new makeup. Who doesn't love new makeup? Honestly, let me tell you, some of these brands haven't really put anything new out due to the pandemic. And now we're getting some new stuff and I'm kind of feeling it, really feeling it, okay? So we have a new foundation, a new sponge, a new contour kit, and something for the cheeks and something for the eyes. So let's get into it. First is going to be the new Morphe Filter Effect Soft Focus Foundation. So I saw Nikki Tutorials doing this on her channel and I was like, ooh, that looks like a nice foundation. But on TikTok, I did see this one chick who was like putting it like little dabs of foundation on um, like toilet paper or like, you know, a piece of like, you know, paper like paper towel or toilet paper or whatever and it's saying like how oily it was and this one looked like it was really oily but nikki was saying like she really likes it then again who knows it could be like sponsored through morphe that's why she should say those nice things i will be honest with it i will tell you i have combination skin i have dry and oily skin like if you touch my face a little bit dry to like areas like my t-zone a little bit my cheeks but that's about it and now with obviously this bald head i gotta like <laughs> foundation it up while I was at Morphe, obviously there was this next to it, and I was like, ooh, this looks great. I think this is the same sponge she used, which is this huge thing. Like, look at this. Like, this is my eye, okay? It covers up my entire eye. I usually use a beauty blender, okay? Obviously, this is wet. This is not right now. But even, it's it's huge. But I love the way it feels. It's like this beautiful velvet feel to it. And it looks like... It's interesting that like that little curve right there, but when I was doing it like this, I'm like, oh, you can get right underneath the eye and I like that. So, let's open it and see. Really, you know, they really should make something for long nails because it's gonna be really getting annoying. Okay, here we go. Ooh. That's glass. That's nice. I got this for $20 and it's glass. Some foundations that come, it comes in a plastic component and it's like $65. This is glass. This is nice. Oh, that, okay. So I like the way this looks right here. Let's see if I can get a little closer so you guys can see. So it's like a nice little curve on top for I think just a perfect way. I think because if you have nails or something, bam, let's get, you know, let's shake it up. So let's see. Oh, I like to do a couple pumps, you know, nothing too crazy. Okay, now I need a mirror. I don't a mirror. Great. All right. Give me one second. Well, I'm going to have to show you guys this anyways. Um, I got myself the Love Sprung Blush Palette. So it's a face palette from Artist Couture. It's a new one. Nails suck. I need to get them. I need to get you out. Uh huh. There you go. Ha ha. Got it. <laughs> Well, while I'm here, I'll tell you this. Uh, love this. Super cute. Love the little pink packaging with the little love sprung in gold. Um, it's nice and, like, you know, pretty good weight. Lid. Like, it's not too heavy, but it's not too light. I like that a lot. And for you guys just to get a quick view of it. There you go. Bam. So I got volume one. Um, volume two was a little too dark for me. So I got volume one. Super cute. Now, with let's dip into the foundation. Okay, so I'm just gonna grab onto the sponge. I'm going here. Oh, hello. Okay.
Hmm. Huh. It's not bad. Obviously, because I'm not like fully wearing it, like, you know, the whole thing. But we'll see. Okay, so I coated my entire face in my head. Um, the sponge is nice. I do like the sponge. Obviously, with nails, it's a little bit harder, too, because especially, especially, like, the fact with my nails, I don't do the whole um, go get them done curlic style. I, they're all press-ons. So it's a little bit difficult, but, like, I mean, it's not a bad foundation. It covered up nicely. A little bit, it, has, it has a nice build to it. So, obviously, you guys saw Artist Couture. <laughs> um, another thing I'm going to be using for, like, contour and highlight and conceal, like, obviously, is um, it's the Vanity Makeup Sculpt and Glow Palette. Um, she came out with two new brushes, um, which are so beautiful. I was lucky enough to actually win a giveaway, and hence why I got them. I mean, I was going to get them regardless at Namie's because for those of you who don't, who don't know who Namie's is, Namie's is like a, kind of like a beauty emporium in LA. Anyone could go buy makeup there, but they do like to support artists and they have great brands like Huda Beauty, Vanity Makeup, Dose of Colors, LC Cosmetics, Persona Cosmetics, Hank and Henry. They have a lot of great brands. They even have some um, like Krylon and some like crazy... Um, makeup brands too so anyways so this is this one right here this is the nose sculpt brush so i think you just basically go in there you get your nosies like this and then this is the buffer side so you just buff it out and then there is this one which is the face sculpting brush which obviously it's like a nice has a nice thing to it so this one, either you can go like this and get it, or you can go sideways and get that really big contour, which is, you know, a lot of girls like that big contour, a lot of guys, you know, just to give it like that Kim K, like, look, it's so funny. Like I do makeup professionally as well, not just on myself, but like on clients and everything. And then it's so funny with my clients, it's very like, okay, we're gonna keep it very minimal. We're gonna do very editorial, like give it very nice. And then like, with me, I'm more like, give me the colors, give me the purples, give me the blues, cut crease, this and that. And like, and it's so funny, like you do know that there is Instagram makeup and then there's actually like editorial makeup. And I personally more enjoy to look at editorial on myself because I am very extra and I love the whole like shebang. I do like um, Instagram makeup. But anyways, okay. So let's go ahead and open this. Here we go again because my nails give me my little tool. <laughs> okay. So when I won the sculpting brushes, which I was so thankful for. Again, Ani, if you're watching, thank you so much for choosing me. Um, I don't know if it, it was actually you who cho chose me. Maybe like when you had like a little generator thing that cho chooses people. But whatever. Thank you again. I honestly appreciate it so much. So I already had the light... Uh, this is the medium trio. I do have the light trio. Um, what I like about the light trio that it was perfect, like the c conceal was very perfect to my like shade and everything. Um, it's just the contour shades a little bit light, so I do like a little darker. That's why I got the medium, so I can like you know, you know, mix it all up. Right here, one, two, three, four. I like to darken it up. One, two. So I always like to angle it out because obviously like, you know, looking like a freak right now. Okay. Top of your forehead. The one thing I do like about her, this cream contour thing, it does uh, blend out actually very nicely. Um, some of them, you know, pe other people have it and they don't blend out as nice or they dry out too fast. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna grab my brush, uh, my sponge, and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to, actually, I think before I do all that, I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm just going to contour my face too. 
Okay, so this is the first time I'm using her brush. So what I like to do is I like to go and I like to find my cheekbone and I like to go right underneath my cheekbone, which is right here. And I like to angle it and like that. Okay. And I like to go right there. So right above the beard. All right, right there. Okay. Then I like to go, I don't like to go all around my forehead, just to the sides like this and connect it nicely. I'm not trying to do that whole three thing that people do, even though it looks like it, but I'm not. So I need a little bit more. Oh, such a thing to like. Okay, all right. Okay, I'll do my nose after, so let's go ahead and let's just buff it out. That's a nice, that's nice. I make a sponge. I'm gonna go ahead and buff this out. Okay, so as you can see, I am now sculpted. Um, I do like the brightness that it does underneath the eyes. I do like, you know, the way my face looks a little chiseled. Um, I will powder and everything after, but I'm going to go in with the nose contour and I'm going to go ahead and just get it at the very end of the brush. And then I'm going to bring it right here, starting from my like eyebrow. I'm just going to go down and I'm going to curve it really nice. I want to get that snatched nose. Then I like to take the back of it and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to brush it out. Ooh. Cute. Okay, great. I like that. I would like to grab some bronzer. And I want to bronze up those contour areas I do have. So I'm gonna go in with my MAC Patrick Star bronzer and give me life. Uh, I'm gonna grab myself a not too crazy brush. Uh, maybe this one right here. Just gonna tap into it lightly. I'm gonna go right there to that bronze. I'm just gonna bronze it out nicely. And go up to the side where my side is right there. Then I'm going to grab myself a little fluffy brush. I'm just going to swirl into it. Nothing too much. And I'm going to go right there where I contour my nose and just bronze it up. I'm going to go into Love Spring. Love Sprung. I'm saying, saying Spring. Love Sprung. Um, it's such a beautiful palette. So there's Swoon Me, Baby Bloom, and Eternal Flame. Um, let me go ahead and get that closer so you guys can see. Um, loving these two. These are gorgeous. And this is like a type of like shimmer. So maybe I'll just put that on a little bit of my cheeks. All right, so. La 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 la. Gotta find myself a nice blush brush. Blush, 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 blush. We can blush with you. Okay, so I'm just gonna get a little crazy and I'm just gonna go ahead and tap into Swoon Me and Baby Bloom. So there's fallout, but I mean, what palette doesn't have fallout? Okay, so I like to smile. I like to actually tap some more off. I coated the brush nicely. Okay, so I like to go give it a nice little smile. And get into the apple of my cheeks. That feels nice. It feels really pretty. It's a really nice cheek. Like, 
I like to add a little bit of my nose just to give it like that younger look. Okay, so feeling this cheek moment. And then I just wanna grab like a little brush. I wanna go into Eternal Flame, which is like that highlight moment. And I like to just go right there. Ooh. Oh yeah. That's absolutely stunning. Loving this. This is actually a really nice blush. I love the little shimmer that comes with it too. Okay, um, so the other two things I got in my new makeup is again from Artist Couture. Um, so we all know their Diamond Light Finisher. This is in Epiphany, you guys. I had to open just this because it literally like there's like a nail thing and I don't want to do it with these nails, so I thought but a little bit got on my hand, you guys. Let me see if I can just get some of my finger. Oh my god. Do you guys see that? Like it's I literally tapped it and look at that purple. We're gonna go ahead, we're just gonna do I'm gonna just keep bringing a little out. I'm gonna grab some of my finger. Because the one I did was not, did not do justice. So they tapped it. Just want to like get like a good amount. Okay. And I'm gonna do this. You guys, can we just appreciate that? Like, what is that? Okay, you know what? It's better. Like, what is this? What is this? Gorgeousness. That's what it is. Gorgeousness. And we got. Their Ethereal Bloom Palette. So obviously he has a thing with packaging. Um, very similar, really nice. Um, this is super cute. I love this little ombre moment. And this is Ethereal Bloom on it. it. Looks very like, you know, like. And the colors are very, very springtime. The colors are very springtime, very gorgeous, very absolutely yes. Go into with the palette. I'm gonna go in with Eternity, which is this beautiful like mauvey nude. I'm just gonna tap into it. Um, if you guys do hear a little bit crying or anything in the background, I do apologize. It is my nephew. Um, he is staying with us during the week uh, because my sister does work. So I'm sorry about that. Okay, so I'm just gonna go in. I'm just gonna make this a nice little transition color. Oh, that's actually really pretty. Just like nothing too crazy. So then I want to go into Petal, which is this beautiful uh, lavender color right here. So let's just go tap that. Just want to get like right into my crease with that one so it looks like a nice little ombre Ooh, that is gorgeous oh that is such a pretty color okay so i definitely want to grab some of that epiphany color and i want to like slap it into my lid all right, put my head back like this because I don't want anything to fall off my face. Wow. It's pretty. It's really pretty. You know, it's like, it's like really, really pretty. Okay, so with the brush, is like, I like to go into the pan. I like to like squeeze down so it picks up nicely. Tap it once. Can you guys see that? Like, oh, it is so gorgeous. So I'm getting a little annoyed with this brush. <sighs> Fuck it. We're gonna go in with my finger. So uh, I'm gonna 
do my pinky. Okay. Grab a little more if I can. Okay. Oh, there we go. Now that's how you do it, boo. Mm. All right, so I'm gonna go in and then I'm gonna actually mix two colors and I'm gonna just drag it underneath my eye. Um, I think I'm gonna go in, I'll tell you guys right now. Give me one second, surprise. Okay, if I get you, thank you. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna mix this color right here, Flourish, and this teal color right here, which is called Angelic. Oh, Angel, Angelic, okay, I got it. Okay, um, I'm just gonna go tap both of them. I don't know what I'm going to create, but we're gonna have some fun because we're ethereal. And voila, that's it, you guys. So, I love the new makeup that I received. It is so amazing. It is so gorgeous. Honestly, I am so in love with this whole collection from Artist Couture. I love this, like, purple moment on my eyes. I love the Vanity Makeup Contour Set. Like, I feel so gorgeous. I feel so ethereal, you guys. It's not even funny. So... Thank you so much for coming and watching my video, you guys. I'm so happy to be back. I'm so happy to see you guys. This is just so amazing. Let me know down in the comments what other videos you'd like to see or what new makeup there is that you do want an honest review. Like I said, I loved everything I got. Didn't hate it. Um, this is just so pretty on me and I'm just so obsessed with it. Thank you so much for coming, guys. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Do not forget to like this video. And, of course, follow me on Instagram. I will be linked down below. Okay, guys. Bye.